Well, she's been missing for three months in South America, and tonight the family and friends of Carla Valpeos came together to keep her case alive. The Detroit woman vanished exploring Peru in December. Her father spending his days there trying to find her, but money is running out. Tonight, the family held a fundraiser at the Arab American National Museum in Dearborn. My family and I are certainly not losing hope. Um, there are a lot of possibilities right now as to where what could have happened to my sister. Um, she could still be alive. Her family is determined to keep investigating the disappearance of a legally blind Detroit woman. Three months ago, Carla Valpoez went to Peru to attend a wedding with friends. She decided to stay longer to see more of the country, but never made her flight back to the U.S. I've been exposed to some things that I wish upon nobody. My father and I have uncovered some incredibly dark corners of that area and of the world. Carla's father has been in Peru ever since. He recorded a heartfelt message for family and friends in America. We appreciate everything that you are doing for us and, and uh, in trying to find Carlita, my Carlita. The family believes if Carla's father leaves Peru, officials will stop investigating her disappearance. Um, my father being down there and his presence is putting a lot of pressure on the Peruvian government as well as the U.S. Embassy to make sure that they see this case through. As the weeks turn into months, this Metro Detroit family is hoping against all odds that this mystery will be solved. We understand that, that um, the more time that passes, um, it, it, uh, it becomes more difficult. You have to stomach the reality of, of the situation. Um, but until we find her, until we find out what had happened to her, um, we're not going to stop. And the family needs help to keep Carla's father in Peru. If you would like to help, we have information on our website. Click on Detroit.com.